Today we're going to look at 10 ways to push down filming costs and pay less because it's something everybody likes to do. One, reduce the number of days filming. Crew costs are high, so less shoot days means the money goes right in your pocket instead of somebody else's. Video crews don't do half days, you have to remember this. So if your shoot is one and a half days of filming, it'll cost you two days. Aim to film more in less days. Be well organized. Plan your shoot day schedule meticulously. Prepare everything, your locations, your times of day, your cast, your props, document everything. Do a visual site inspection first, like go walk about, look at everything. Is there any rubbish that might appear in the background? Is somebody not wearing the correct PPE? Check all these things. Inspect it first. Be sure that nothing is missing or wrong, or you might overrun. Or maybe even, you can get three days filming into two days, or even two days into one, just by being organised. Use a local video company. You'll save immediately on crew travel costs. Now you need to be sure they're experienced in what you want. Now a local business video company who double as weddings or events film companies, they have got really good camera ops and editors. They might have much business experience, but they know their equipment. Now animation companies are less likely, so find a local video company. Don't add extra filming days. This happens with VIP interviews where you've got to go to some special place or some sort of special demo which needs an extra day of filming. Don't add days for one special thing or person if you can possibly avoid it. You'll keep your costs down this way. It's cheaper to bribe a VIP or customer or group of customers to come to you than to film them each individually. Same for demos. Organise it. Write your own script. If you write your own script first, you can control the video's length and cost. So before you get in touch with any video company, write down what you think your script should say. It doesn't have to be perfect, but I'll tell you why it works for you. You can reckon every 115 words you write is about a minute of filmed video. And a day filming produces about five minutes of finished video. So a 500 word script could be filmed in a day using that rate, but a 700 word script can't. So get your script length as short as possible and then you can figure out how many days filming you need, then you can go out for a quote. Be your own director. Hiring a director is an extra cost. If you can find an experienced camera op you can work with on the filming day, you'll save. Now, they need to be experienced, so you might want someone who's maybe a bit older than a bit younger, but you can trust them to take the shot in the right way. You need to show them what you want and what you need, and you may want to check their footage, but they will film it properly and you can trust them. Reduce the number of locations filmed. You want less crew time spent marching from place to place, because if that happens, it means you've got more time for actual filming. And all that counts from a filming day is when the record button on the camera is being pressed. Everything else, there's nothing being recorded. So try and get the least number of locations with the less crew walkabouts between shots, and you'll get more filmed. Film in fewer locations wherever possible, and this can avoid an extra day of filming. 8. Cut out the frill. Frill means drones, actors, presenters and animated graphics. Don't use them. They'll all push up your film video costs much higher. Stick to voiceover and captions. Use voiceover and not interviews. Interviews are always unpredictable. I've interviewed a thousand people. They're always tricky. They're never predictable. You never know what you're going to get. And they're also tricky to edit well. And all this takes time and it gives room for error and overruns. Avoid them and stick to voiceover. Point and shoot. 10. Avoid drama or recreating events. Stick to point and shoot, it's quicker and easier. Recreating events, even demos, is more difficult than you would estimate and it's more likely to increase your costs. You won't get overruns if you don't do them. So aim to get more for less. Now Business Video News, that's the name of our newsletter. It's going to keep you up to date with industry expert opinion, news and advice, which everybody needs. Subscribe. There are no strings attached. I recommend you do. That's it. 10 ways to push down filming costs and pay less. Okay, back to work.